Welcome to the assessment walkthrough for VU21989 Event 2. In this short screencast, we'll cover the installation of Python Nmap from the source. I'll cover actually using Python Nmap in the next video. Now to get Python Nmap installed. We're going to be using the manual installation option and the link for that is in the description below. Our first step is we're going to make a directory and we're going to call it SRC. Let's say uh, just short for source. Now that we've got our directory created, we're just going to change into that directory by using the cd command. Now we're into this directory, we're going to download the files for, for Python nmap and we're going to use the wget command for that. Now that we have our Python nmap zip file downloaded, let's do an ls-l just to check to see if it downloaded to where we um, wanted it to download. And there we can see it there. As you can see, it's a tar.gz. Tar stands for tape archive. .gz is the GNU zip program. So our first order of business, you could do this in one step, I'm just going to do it in two to make it a little bit easier to follow. Our first order of business, we're just going to gunzip our Python. So we're just going to go PYT and then hit the tab key. Now when we do an ls-l now, we'll see that we have the gunzip file is now just a tar. As you can see, it's now tar. Now we're going to extract the archive from the tar. So that's just a tar dash xvf and then python tar let's do an ls l just to check to see what's in now in our um, src folder as you can see when we extracted the archive it it created a new folder called python nmap etc and we need to change directory into there now that we're in there, let's do another ls-l. I'll just clear the screen first to give me more room. And we can see that we have our files in there. The file that we're going to be interested in is the setup.py. Our next step is to set up our, our Python nmap. So to do that, we're going to use that setup.py. We'll do a sudo, we'll go python3, setup, and install. Put in our super secret password and nmap has now been, or Python nmap has now been installed. Let's do control L and we're going to CD into our home directory. And now we're going to run Python, Python 3, and we're going to make sure that Python nmap module has been installed by just doing an import nmap. If we get no error, this will mean that it has imported correctly it looks like we've imported correctly. In the next video, we'll go through how to use the nmap or the Python nmap module with a few commands.